Hello gardeners, this is the Flora Faunaful channel and I'm Martina and it's the Great Tomato Trial week 15 I think. I can't believe it's already that much. I will show you a little bit of what I did. I have harvested quite a bit and I will show you how much I did of each kind. Number one and two starting to ripen, looking really good. I really like this piccolini. I think it's in a good place. Um, it was tied up well. I liked number nine as well. I think it, when it gets west and south facing um, sun, I think that's the best. These are definitely the biggest tomatoes that I've gotten um, from this variety. So I'm really excited about that. And here again, the Harbinger. Also one that I would consider doing next year as well. And probably doing them on a cordon instead. So as you can see, I pulled out a lot of stuff on the weekend in the garden. Getting a little bit ready for autumn and fall and winter. Oh, boo -hoo. But I will show you a little bit about the work I did on the weekend after this. So number three that turned into a cucumber is doing well. I'm getting a lot of little flowers and little tomatoes. Uh, cucumbers. Some of them are getting a little bit bigger. So quite pleased. Number four, trimmed back. It is the crimson bush. And they're also getting bigger. Look at that. So I've got two right here. And I think that is just about it. Oh, we've got another two, three down there. You can see, not quite as big. So, not maybe the right plant in the right area. Number five, something that I don't know what it is. It might be another crimson blush. It's definitely not a cherry tomato. We shall see. Number six, the subarctic plenty. It's really starting to redden up. I only have those three, I believe. Now we have another little one, but I doubt that that's going to come into fruition. I don't know why everything just kind of stopped after a couple of them. Number six, uh, seven and eight. Um, on its way out, but there's still a few that I can harvest. They just need to get a little bit redder. This is 6A. The one that's left behind from last year. Number nine. Ooh, let me get out of the way. Number nine. I did a whole lot of gardening on the weekend, as you could see before. And I got a lot of them, but look, they're all ripening up even more, which is very nice. I took out number 10, that didn't do anything, grew really nice, then got all curly leaved, and then I just take it, took it away, so that is out. <coughs> number 11, another piccolini. Looks like it's starting to turn a nice shade of orange, so I'm happy with that. Number 13 and 14. is the piccolini in the back facing west and I've done a lot of harvesting as you can see and it's looking good we'll get another harvest hopefully in the weekend 15 another piccolini also another harvest lots of them um, I think about 
is it 400 grams? Uh oh. What? Okay. Number 16. The San Marzano. Starting to turn a little bit. I don't like the color of the leaves. Um, I'll probably. Maybe I'll grow them next year, I don't know. 17, let me see, is the Roma. Looking very nice, looking very nice. They are the Roma. No, these are the San Marzanos. Why do I keep getting it mixed up? The San Marzanos are definitely one I'll grow again next year. 18 is another Ailsa Craig. I can tell that the sun is lower than it was before. It's not shining on here right now, maybe in a little bit. No signs of getting red, but good crop. Excellent crop. Number 20, or 19, is the one that kind of fell over, having some teething issues, but it does have a few. Little ones, we'll see what happens there. I'm not expecting a lot. Number 20 is the Ailsa Craig. Looking good. I have to take down my beans. I think they're ready for harvest. I'll do that in the next couple of days. And take that contraption down. 21 is another Ailsa Craig, and it's also starting to redden up. It has quite a bit of fruit, so I'm really excited about that. I really do like the Ailsa Craig. I can save the seeds, and that will be good for next year's crop. And here's my totem, the three for 20. Look at that nice one. It's not quite red, red, red yet, but it's getting there. There's an orange one, and there's a little baby one. So, not too bad for nine, 99.